You seem shorter than I remembered, Basim. Hmm. And you still have not grown a single digit, Rebecca. No, we're not here as enemies. No, but we never held back on the training ground. Roshan tells me you are local here. In a manner of speaking, I lived here a time before I left for Anbar. Hmm. This place is no different from the places I'm used to. The rich wipe their shit with the clothes of the poor. That is the Karch I remember. It is your car no longer. Rebecca has uncovered a district tainted by corruption. Stronger than usual. Rumors of harassment from officials, and goods being controlled and seized. We think someone here has a hold over the district. Let me guess. The Order. A grand auction is happening. The Dairat Al-Mal. An annual show of silk robes comparing their golden spoons. No surprise, but this event is invite only. There is a high chance one of our targets will attend. So, gain entry into the auction and find the one behind this. Mumtaz, you catch on quick. Finding it hard to keep up? There might be clues. It betrays trouble to the root. I can show you where they are brewing. Join me outside when you're ready. There are some contracts on the board, if you can find the time. Rebecca, do you have some time? I have a few questions. Fire away. What else do you know about the Deirat al-Mal? A specially curated place. One for the rich to display their bounty. Does an event like that happen frequently here? If the local merchants are to be believed, it happens once a year. But I'm sure there are no shortages of parties for the wealthy. What else? What have you learned about Karch? I want to see it from fresh eyes. <laughs> Nothing that I'm not used to. Corruption, poverty. But the souk is vibrant. The spices, the materials, and oh, the tools. So many things I could experiment with. Already thinking about taking a break. Oh, calm down. I know where my focus lies. What else? You know a little bit about me and where I am from. What about you, Rebecca? <laughs> Since when do you want to know more about me? Come now. We are on the same side. Does not hurt to get to know who you are working with. <laughs> well, I'm not from here. But let's just say my parents would not be out of place in an event like the Grand Auction. You came from riches? Shamefully so. As a child, I never enjoyed the glamour, the dress-up, and the manners. It was also suffocating. It all changed when I stepped outside of our gates one day and saw the world for what it really is. I have never turned back since. What else? No more questions. Shukran, Rebecca. Master. Are you ready, Basim? Kar awaits. Ready. Let us move. Follow me. Ever thought you would return here? To Kar? No. Much of my childhood was spent along these streets. Finding friendship with rats and roaches. Some memories are good. Most are bitter. 
Memories only serve to distract us. The Order has spread their influence into every crack in the city, turning Baghdad into their farm. That will change. Responsibility lies heavy on our shoulders. The Order's blight falls over Kar, and we are the only ones who can cure it. How has Rebecca been adjusting to Kar? She does not like the politics, but she has to fulfill her duty. Kar is an acquired taste. Businesses at each other's throats. The obsession over money. <laughs> Perfume. People here are happy to be lost in their own paradise. A paradise that can only be afforded by the wealthy, and often corrupted. Come, we're nearly there. Welcome back to Kar. <sighs> Spice still clings to the air. What was it like, the first time you took a life? I barely recall. It was a man I used to know well. Before all of this. Before the Hidden Ones. You do not remember? My memories are buried next to him. I refuse to let his death hunt me. The way his breath hunted me when he was alive. I won't let the past define me. This is why I now consider myself the daughter of no one. If we do not quell the storm within us while awake, it takes us in our dreams. Like with you and your Jinni. Now, the Souk, like Rebecca said, some guards came through recently. <sighs> Breaking bottles, smashing crates. What caused this aggression? Let's find out. I've also heard they're seizing foreign goods. Mostly from the East Road. The East Road? I believe I know someone who can help. It has been an age. Hopefully he is still around. I would be happy to see him again. Do not let nostalgia cloud reality, Basim. I will not. I know nothing stays the same. It has been some time. I wonder what has changed around here. Maybe I could first pay an old friend a visit. <laughs> 